This video is for very rich people. Why would you waste your money on stupid things like anything with a name brand on it? Why wouldn't you have everything be bespoke? I think most of you rich people are doing it super duper wrong. If it has a name brand on it, anybody with money can just go get one, which makes it pretty much the opposite of special. If they have the right connections or they've bought the right things, they can have it too. Or instead of all of that, you could hire a master to make everything that you want. You want a new $40,000 Birkin bag? What do you think $40,000 could be in the hands of a master purse maker? Sorry, I don't know what y'all are called. I looked it up. It's literally bag maker. So in the hands of a master bag maker, what do you think a $40,000 budget could do? Probably something a lot more interesting than a Birkin bag. And who am I to poo poo on Birkin bags? Literally no one. I am no one. But if you are tens of thousands of dollars worth of Birkin bag rich, because I think I'd be a better rich person than you, I don't know. I feel like the normies shouldn't be able to even identify what I'm wearing because it's that nice. I would hire somebody for everything. I use a coffee cup every day. I would have a master potter make it. A master tailor would make all of my clothing. A master gardener would help me pick out all of my plants every year for my garden. A master scissor maker would make the scissors that I use every day. A master baiter would set all the lines that I need for my fishing trip. A master jeweler would design a spoon for me to scoop out all of my pigments from all of my cute little jars that I would have somebody make for me too. I would have handmade glass jars. I would definitely have a handmade beautiful glass paint muller. Um, and I'm not Birkin bag rich, but I bet with, with a little bit of savings and some hard work, I bet I could save up for a handmade paint muller. So if you know anybody that can do handmade glass paint muller with stuff inside of it, like fun designs and things, hit me up. Talk to me. I want to know you. Anyway, I think I'd be better at being rich um, than the rich people that I observe. But as a poor, I just personally think that I shouldn't even be able to identify what you're wearing. It should be so nice that I don't even know what it is. That quiet rich, that quiet luxury or whatever that I heard Charles Gross talk about. The most peaceful man on this entire app. Quiet luxury. Quiet very lovely. If I was a super rich, I would be quiet about it. But because I'm a loud poor, I will complain about it and show you things that I wish I had enough money to buy. Anyway, all of this stuff is from the Corning Museum of Glass. I love glass. If it's made out of glass, I probably am very interested in it. I love marbles. If I was Birkin bag rich, I would have a collection of handmade exceptional marbles. But I would actually have to be about Birkin bag rich to be able to afford those. So that's not really too much of a stretch. Anyway, goodbye. This video is long and stupid. Bye. Bye. Thank you if you stuck around this long. Subscribe. <laughs> Goodbye.